is dedicated to Johnny D. Lloyd. I have a seven pound Dumbo. Seven pounds. And I'm going to demonstrate the bicep moves I talked about. So here a normal creature curl. A normal, a normal creature curl. But the pose for uh, inner and outer biceps, heads, so outer, or no, inner, uh, is to the side. Is to the side. And outer is across your body or with a hammer grip. So you want to go across and stupidly, or just across. But to do that with this, so I do this, so I'm facing into the direction of the bench, not, not the normal direction. And then I put my upper arm over. And I go like that. Then you have to keep the shoulder, the whole arm and shoulder making contact with the with the bench. And then for the inner, I sit. So both not facing this way. But I sit and go like that. But this is just seven pounds. This is just seven pounds. So imagine with a <laughs> hundred pounds. Yeah. <laughs> wait a minute, what else did I need to show? Oh wait, there's more to show. There's more stuff to show, I think. I think, wait. Tom came with Eli. Hey, Andy. Hello. I have more stuff to show Johnny D. Light. So when I do um, straight arm bicep stuff, what I like to do is if I'm not um if I'm not lying down and just pressing straight down, and when you do this, you can press with your whole arm up to your shoulder. So you can have the whole arm touching the floor and then press with the whole arm. But what I like to do when I'm not doing that is I spread my legs and then I press down like that. So I have I have um my whole body. If if you could lift your whole body, you could press from here and you would lift up. But I'm not strong enough. Um, and another way is you can lie down and um, have the non-working arm on the side, which you're going to press with it because you can press this way, but that will normally lift you up like, like this. But instead of turning yourself, you can have this arm over here. Press down so that you um you prevent yourself from turning and lifting your weight. So I can press, and then with, with this hand, I'm I'm pressing over here, and then so and that's how um you can train with straight arms for biceps, and then uh oh. Oh, Zan's leg. Um, um, also, uh, you can get a dumbbell and, um, do straight arm curls, or you can take your hand and put the other hand over it and turn it like super day. And then press down on it. But if your tricep and lat isn't strong enough, then, then you won't be able to press it down much. So if if your tricep and lat is stronger than your bicep and front out, then you can do it this way. 
But then this will work your front out and the bicep curls will, but all this on the floor will, and then, uh, um, then, um, the butcher I was talking about, and this, this is where Johnny D lied on Twitch. So the push-up I was talking about is like this. So you press from your waist and lifts you up. But normally at the top, you're supposed to stay up. So that would be like if, if I could keep going forward and then stay up. But I can't. Um, I kind of can if I do that. Like an elbow lever. Like I have my elbows tucked in. But normally your your arms are out. And you just planch. Full planch. Or you can spread your legs. And that's straddle planch. That's easier. Um, Zom's night. Hey. Hello. Hello, hello. I had a lot of chatters in Twitch earlier. I mean, viewers, not chatters. But they loved it. I don't know who they were. I didn't check chat. Should I have checked chat? What if, what if people were watching me who I know? And they didn't tell me. They didn't say, hey, it's perfect fitness streaming. Or hey, I, I I made it to one of your streams. They just what if it was one of my friends, one of the people I watch, and they came in and then they just left. That sucks, bro. You you want to build good friendships. So like Top Gear Eli and Sam Slay said something and Jonathan said something. But what if you have friends who come in and, like, they don't say anything? Like, that sucks. You don't want that. Wait, I forgot. What else do I need to show Johnny? Wait, there's probably one more thing. If I can think of it. There's probably one more thing. Oh. I can't. Okay. Well, I'm gonna make a clip of that later. A highlight. A highlight. Yeah. Oh wait. Oh wait. I can show Johnny more stuff. Ooh. I can show him the cardio stuff I was talking about. So Johnny, here's the here's the jumping cardio I was talking about. So you jump up and down and back up. And back go from back down immediately without pause. And then on the other leg, let me get weights, light weight. So you can get light weight and then do it weighted. But you have to balance. And first, oh wait, I should have shown this first. So so first, um, first you have to do um, one-legged hopping. So some people, the first time they do it, can already do it well because they're like skinny. But I wasn't that skinny. So uh, you start hopping, and when you hop on one leg with the other leg, you raise. The knee. So you want to use that for momentum. And um, you uh, you uh, uh, you don't want really to use ankle weights because um, 
It's uh, it's not good over five pounds because um, the ankle weights, unless you can get them like really tight around your ankle, like a good fit, and like not um flopping around or touching the ground, and um um if you use dumbbells, it's better to train vertical, like your vertical jump. Because that's what Johnny D. Light said he wanted to improve. And ankle weights will improve you, but it's mainly hip flexors. Because you have to lift up your leg. So it's mainly for hip flexors. So for hip flexors, there's a move I do where I get into a lunge, and then I press it up with the front leg, and while I'm in the air, I'm pressed with the back leg. And normally people have a really hard time with that. Like they get really sore, but I'm stronger. So I can, when I press with the back leg, I can jump up and with added weight. Um, so that moves easy for me now. But if you want to make it harder, you can go lower. Um, but it's still, it's like an intermediate move. And then, I mean, it's technically an advanced move. I just don't consider myself advanced in legs that much. But, um, and then, uh, also, the shoes I have have this um, structural support. So it's like, um, has these ridges and stuff, and, uh, the insole is good for, um, cardio, because it's, um, a power step pinnacle insole, so it's, like, thicker, it's, like, thicker, but I've worn it a lot, but it's still good, um, Wait, the other, the other insole has the name of the brand on it. That one doesn't. Um, um, and, uh, um, so, uh, I don't know if you know, but there's other um, advanced body weight moves. So you said, um, Johnny, do you like people asking you to do a pistol squat? So there's a shrimp squat, a pistol squat, um, a sissy squat, and then there's um, calisthenic leg extensions, and then there's uh, there's slick floor bridge curls. I don't know if you know. I just do one. There's <laughs> slick floor bridge curls, and then. And then I want to show you, if you don't know, the Nordic leg curl. So I guess I'll put the bone over here again. There's, it's the Nordic leg curl. So it's where you, um, the Nordic leg curl is where, like, you fall down and then pick yourself back up. With your toes and strings. And then, um, with, uh, with, uh, oh yeah, and then, um, if I can show you for triceps, there's, if you, uh, if you lie down and do your, uh, tricep extensions, you can, um, uh, stretch out your tricep. And then just do baby reps. So like, so like, um, I'll just get the seven pounds again because they're really light. Um, so you can, and you can um, hold at the top. So it's weighing down more at the bottom. So it's weighing down on your tricep. And then just do like baby reps for your triceps. And then, 
Um, there's also for uh, for rear doubts. What I like to do to work them in a stretched position is do this. So I cross my body, but you don't have to lift all the way up. And then, um, if you lie down and try to press straight down, it works your lats and triceps. Um, and you can go wider or narrower. Um, and and there's avros too that kind of work your triceps. Like there's avros um that I can do with these slidey pad things. Like even on my knees, it's kind of hard. And then, um, you can also, like, do, um, body weight tricep extensions, and then a one-arm, um, 